back everybody, this is Free Rain Nomad coming at you. I uh, finally got a day off, I'm excited to go around and see some of the sights around here in Little Rock, Arkansas. Uh, the bus is still coming along, tried to get it up here uh, last weekend and it didn't go so well. Uh, engine was missing, uh, a brake pad came apart, uh, still having a problem with the alternator and the charging, but all in all, we're still at it. Uh, got a diesel mechanic working on that miss, and uh, got another gentleman, a uh, friend of mine, working uh, to redo all the brakes, uh, brake pads, calipers, everything like that. Because uh, it's got to be 100% ready to go uh, to make this trip and be able to live in it, you know, 100% of the year. So, anyway, uh, I just came, like I said, I came out here to visit uh, some of the popular attractions and. Here we have the Maritime Academy uh, submarine tour. And, you know, me, uh, like I said before in one of my past videos, uh, I spent 10 years of my life on the inland and offshore tugboats and tank barges. So, uh, I'd like to maybe share some a little bit with y'all uh, and some of the history around here in Little Rock, Arkansas. So, let's take a look. Here we're at the uh, Arkansas Inland Maritime Museum, uh, home of the USS Razorback. SS 394 <laughs> and uh, there's a lot of uh, neat maritime history I think to see uh, we'll walk down here uh, as you can see on the other side of this building right here uh, there's a submarine back here we're gonna go check that out there's a tugboat and see some of the things uh, they got going on here Submarine propeller taking off the USS Razorback while in Tur country of Turkey. Uh, their diameter is seven foot nine inches with a pitch of six foot five point three seven six inches. They weigh 2,767 pounds. Uh, the top speed with these uh, wheels were 24.6 knots. Here we have uh, couple of anchors let's see what does this say uh, anchor from USS Arkansas a nuclear power guided missile cruiser the USS Arkansas CGN-41 was the fifth vessel named for the state she circumnavigated the globe in 1984 and participated in Operation Desert Shield and Desert Storm this uh, anchor here Found during landscaping of the waterfront, this type of stock or old-fashioned anchor was used around the world until the 19th century. The stocks are the arms that stick out at the top perpendicular to the flute. Look at the size of that chain. I've dealt with a lot of that uh, kind of stuff on the uh, offshore tugs. Well, let's uh, see what we got uh, down here. Pretty big submarine and a pretty big tugboat there from the US Navy.
like my new shirt. Thank you Howie, Roll, Howie Express uh, t-shirts and decals. Uh, been a big help. And we're going to see up here there's a walkway that goes across the river. We're right here on the Arkansas River. And uh, there's a river market down there. And so we're going to go check that out. Uh, there's a way to drive over there over to the other side. Uh, not going to really feel like walking all the way across the day. So anyway, uh, Y'all stay tuned, we'll go check out the river market. Uh, police presence down here and uh, a lot of pubs they're big on uh, draft beers uh, custom breweries small time breweries a lot, of, a lot of things to do around here you stay tuned because you never know what's going to happen next see ya